before this video starts i want to say this video is particularly for those people who are scoring less than 180 marks in their mock test if you are scoring more than 180 marks i'm not the right person to guide you because i have improved from 57 to 184 marks during my jee days so if you are scoring more than 180 marks please stop this video here itself and use your precious time somewhere else so if you are still here you are one among those who are scoring between 0 to 180 before getting to this i am abulash i have cracked jee mains with 97 percentile with a transformation of 39 percentile to 97 percentile also cleared jee advanced with 19k rank in 2022 and i am currently a second year undergraduate in edu dukapur if you are still continuing this video i want one promise from you you got to put your 100 percentage you got to work harder than you ever did in your life if you are not going to do so this video is never meant for you just stop this video here itself and go use your precious time in some other stuff and those who haven't even wrote a mark see it doesn't matter if you have completed your syllabus or not you have done enough revision or not you have practiced enough questions or not before going to the real match if you didn't play it real match no matter how much talented player you are no matter how much confidence you have you are going to get fucked up so I request you people to stop overthinking and go write that first mock exam and come back here okay so i am going to separate you guys into two categories based on your mock exam scores is that 90 to 180 gang and less than 90 gang so let's talk about 90 to 180 gang so if you're scoring between 90 to 180 i can see you have been working hard for the past two years at least one year even though if you lost consistency here and there you kept going good work on that though but now to improve you got to analyze yourself one thing take a paper and write down your strongest average and weakest topics based on solving problems I'm not asking that favorite subject or topic that excites you. I'm asking based on the amount of answers you're getting right off. For example, for me Max is my favorite subject, but I used to score more in chemistry than Max. So let's separate into three types. Strongest, average, weakest, right? So in strongest there will be again three parts Max, physics, chemistry. And in so as average, so as weakest. So I'm saying my strongest thing. You have to write your strongest. Okay. For me, say Max me uh, integration, matrix, uh, differential equations, vector algebra, statistics, binomial. These are my strongest. And physics me thermodynamics, uh, KTG, um, current, electromagnetic waves. The whole modern physics. In chemistry me, the whole organic chemistry basically because of the mentor I got. and coordination compounds uh, atomic structure these are my strongest basically and i have to like you have to write for the weakest and also average just don't include the topics you never learned so let's say you made it now your prime goal should be to make that strong topic so strong and that average topic to be a strong topic and the weakest topics just chodu do so how are you going to do it I want you to write one mark every day, or at least every alternate days, one mark should be written. So, so you are taking three hours to write your mark, and after that, take your time to analyze it properly. Okay, that's where the major role is. So, while you are analyzing, make sure you are separating at its same as strong, average, and weak topics. So, the prime goal should be the mistake you made in your strong topic should never be done again, and the mistake you did in your average topic. should be improved so you wrote a mock today you have analyzed it you have figured out your mistakes and you have did a good amount of questions in the mistake you did in your strongest topic so that the mistake is not going to repeat cuz you are already strong in the topic you are making it now extra strong so you can always trust that topic and also you are improving in your average topics day by day is that you got to pick a single topic first and make it strong and then move to the next topic so the more marks you write the more analyze you are going to do the more mistakes you figure out the more you going to correct it the more marks you going to get so there was a time where i was scoring 
144 is that between 130 to 145 in the 144 was my highest at that time and i was stuck in that for like for past 5 6 marks straight and by using the same technique within around 20 to 25 days is that like around uh, 12 marks i guess i have improved from 144 to 184 so i can guarantee you one thing if you exactly did same as i said you can at least ex expect an hike of 20 to 50 marks so let's talk about less than 90 guys so if you're scoring less than 90 marks it means you're trying to give your best but somehow here and there it's not working out for you you're thinking some topics that you're strong enough but while doing problems most of them are not getting it right right i was once in your situation so i can totally relate so i think i can also help you out before getting into this just ask this question to you i am maybe working hard enough but am i working smart enough it's still a question mark right let's work smartly now first of all stop thinking that someone will come and take you out of this no one is coming literally no one even god is not coming you have to take yourself out of this so i have to say you something frankly okay don't demotivate yourself target april attempt then january attempt if you are really serious about je you have to accept the fact okay it's not going to work within a month so take january as an experience and crack april attempt and the same thing applies for you too same as 90 to 180 gang but you don't have to write a mark every day or every alternate day. Write a mark weekly once and do PAQs. That's what's going to improve you. Select a topic, revise it, analyze the mistakes that are did in the mark, do PAQs in that topic, make the topic so strong and repeat it. Okay? So if you're seeing this video until this point, I know you are very much serious about Jay. And be proud of yourself. You're already in the two percentage gang who are working hard to win in life and one day you will so i'm not going to waste your time by saying some motivational lines i know you are already in that motivated gang just remember this one thing if i can do it you can also do it so just do it be an example i believe in you just comment below how much marks you're scoring now and set a target there how much you will be scoring after these many days and do it take it as a challenge and complete it and if you want any other help any doubts just comment below i will definitely reply back all the best you're never gonna make it you're not good enough there's a million other people with the same stuff you really think you're different and you must be kidding think you're gonna hit it but you just don't get it it's impossible